This is everything I ate and how much it cost at Nishiki Market in Kyoto, Japan. Now I had some ambitious plans ahead, but I knew I had to get warmed up first with a strawberry mochi. I thought the tart strawberries and sweetness of the red beans inside harmonized really well. As I continued onward, I found this Snoopy waffle stall. These puppies can be filled with either custard or red bean. Personally, I'm a bit of a red bean fanboy, so you're not going to catch me slipping out. That being said, the waffle was my favorite part. Not too sweet. Up next, I found this cauldron of rolled chicken thighs on a stick. These kids were super tender, not too fatty, and the sweet soy sauce flavor permeated throughout all the meat. Up next, I have a personal rule. Whenever I see a lazy river of donuts, I gotta buy some. These were super hyped up, and they were pretty average. Ooh, then I found these little totem poles of octopi, and I got to eat it fresh off the grill. For me, the only flavor that was really coming through was the char. But I wanted to be fair to the octopus species, so I gave them a shot at redemption by ordering some takoyaki. Now, these were much better. They were sauced up, filled with tons of toppings, and served piping hot. That's all. Good night.